down to size. Hello everybody, I'm Gamester522 and welcome back to more Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. How long has it been? A let's play that I have put on hold for far too long. Now, instead of just sitting here and moping, let's just get on with it. So we were, we had to come here, I already forgot this place, Shinjuku, yes, in order to investigate this. Feels like something's out to kill. Hmm? A case came in from Detective Matayoshi. Hurry up and come. What? You felt something ominous in the air just now? Since when have you been so superstitious? It's probably nothing. Just get back here so we can get to work already. I should see if there's a new case to investigate. Well, that didn't take long. Alright, might as well head back to the agency. Now, to be fair, I think the real reason I've been holding off on this Let's Play is because I feel like it'll be subpar compared to my others. And plus, I'm terrified of just the fact that I'm playing on hard mode. But, I reap what I sow. I need to go in the Digi Lab and heal right quick. There we go. Oh yeah, I need to check. I was about to say, do I have Digimon in here? No, I do not. Ah yes, I can expand my farm. Might as well do that. Okay, now this farm is at max rank. Now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get... I need to get two more developer know-hows. Costs a shit ton of money, but it'll be worth it. Now, we have already gotten all of our Tactician USBs, so we don't need to worry about that. But since I have a maxed out farm, I figured I might as well go ahead and let's see here. This is who we have in our team right now. Now, let's see. Okay, we want to get all of our builders. Okay, so we have Gomamon, Tentamon, Falcomon. Okay. Damn it, that's not what I meant. Gomamon. Tentamon. Falcomon. Let's see. Shogun Gekumon. Geku, I mean Goku Mon. Shogun Gecko. Gecko! God damn it. Solar Mon. Let's see. XV Mon is a builder? Okay. We're not using him at the moment, so why not? Gargomon, Geo Greymon. Okay. Okay, let's see. Gigadramon. Man, it's been so long since I've last seen this that it's just like, holy shit. Okay, Sunflamon. There we go. So we have 10 builders in our farm. Let's see. I can add islands, so that's good. I haven't messed with this too much, but I figured I might as well take the time to work on this. Gonna use all my expansions. There we go. 
Of course, this farm isn't really ready yet. We have this one right here. Basically, I want to go ahead and just do develop. We're just going to develop at 10,000 as much as we can. All right. I healed and everything. I have my team with me, so I think we're good to go. All right, let's see what we got. Ah, new story mission. Broad daylight. An invisible slasher is rampant in Shinjuku. Catch the cobra before something serious happens. There's been a string of some real oddball incidents lately out in Shinjuku. Cars, trees, building exteriors are all getting sliced up. And with clean cuts, too. Like someone took a real sharp knife to them. Thankfully, nobody has actually gotten hurt by this so far. Right now, it's just a case of trying to curb vandalism we're dealing with here. But it's heavy-duty stuff getting damaged here. Imagine if people started getting targeted somewhere as dense as Shinjuku. It'd be a real problem. As long as we don't know, as long as we don't know who's behind this, we can't predict what'll be next. And the police can hardly be bothered to get their get off their asses. And like this will help us. It's it's after the like this will help us. It's after the last incident. I see what this is going. All right, we'll check it out for you. I've hacked into. I mean. I've uh, politely borrowed access to, the, to a security camera in Shinjuku so we can check out what's been recording. I don't see anything and I damn well don't hear anything right now either. Doesn't look like I can find anything of the actual crime scene, though I'd wager that you've already checked on this much yourself. Is that... There's really nothing left on there, huh? Oh, <laughs> I just found something interesting. Here's my trusty assistant from just a while ago. Let's take a look. Wait, what was that flash of light just now? Hmm. We just might have a real live Kamai... Kama... Kamaitachi on our hands here. You've probably heard about them before from folklore tales, right? Or folk tales. God damn it, all this reading. Kamaitachi are weasel spirits with claws as sharp as a sickle. To hear the stories tell it... To hear the stories tell... To hear the story... Wait, what? Oh, I'm sorry, that's weirdly worded. To hear the stories tell it, they attack people by appearing inside a sudden whirlwind, cutting their victim's skin sharply in its wake. What probably really happens is that when people's skin gets really dry, it can, it can get cut up by small rocks blowing in the wind, or so we thought. Looking at this footage, I think it's safe to say this is a, that's no ordinary gust of wind. Knowing that, there well could be an actual Kamaitachi on the loose in Shinjuku. Putting fairy tales aside for the moment, what do we know is that light reflected off something? Maybe the wind somehow, or a blade? Or maybe something else entirely, who knows? But that light definitely skimmed really close to your head there in that footage. If you hadn't felt anything ominous back there, you might be seeing your head pop off your shoulders. Heh, <laughs> better stay sharp. You can only stay lucky for so long, you know. Head back to Shinjuku and investigate the surrounding area. Detective Matayoshi and I will stay here and analyze the footage some more. All right, so I guess it's back to Shin back off to Shinjuku, I guess. Time to go see what the deal is. There's a thin line coursing through here that looks like a burn mark. Wait, a burn mark? You found a burnt spot, you say? Hmm. Anything of else note you found there? What's wrong? Does something feel off again? A flash of sunlight reflected off a window and blinded you? Hmm. Hey, looks like you froze Kyo for the time being. Oh wait, there she goes. She's moving again. I guess she's looking something up. <laughs> Once she's like this, she's lost on her own world. No point trying to talk with her. Looks like she'll be at it for a while. 
I hate ordering you around since you don't work for me, but would you mind looking around for more clues for us? We've had a lot of reports about this phenomenon, kind of the police department. So there could definitely be something left to find. Okay, then. Who's texting me? Well, that's Monzamon. Monzamon looks like a bear. There's another one of these burn marks on the sidewalk here. I feel it. That murderous intent again. God damn it. That murderous intent again. Oh, fuck. Don't hurt me. <laughs> You're too slow. Hey, it's me. I figured out what's going on. The culprit, whoever they are, is using reflections to their advantage. Have you ever heard of the walkie-talkie building? It's a super tall skyscraper in London that was at the center of a real bizarre incident. Basically, there were cars parked nearby that mysteriously had parts of them melted and warped. The cause of it was the building's windows. The panes were installed in such a way they reflected a sunbeam potent enough to damage the cars. In this instance, though, we're not dealing with sun rays. Judging from the flash of light and those burn marks you found, we're probably dealing with lasers here. But this isn't your ordinary laser pointer we're talking about. Only weapon-grade lasers could leave such deep burns. The question is how someone managed to set them up all around Shinjuku and fire them off without people spotting them. There hasn't been any big power surges in the area. Could there be batteries? No, wait. The digital wave readings are fluctuatingly weird. Don't tell me they're using the digital waves as a substitute for microwaves in an impromptu maser. If that's the case, then. Hey, think, I can, think you can trust in my deductions and your good luck to pull us through? <laughs> like, I'd ne like I'd ever doubt your judgment. I like that attitude. Then here's the deal. The culprit is aiming that laser at you using every reflective surface in the area. We're going to use that to our advantage. The fact that a laser is bouncing around towards you means we can trace it back to its origin point. To do that, you need to get in the line of fire, but you have to time it well or else you'll get a hole burnt right through your skull. Do you get what I'm asking here? As soon as that laser's got you, I want you to connect jump into it and dive inside. Seriously? If my thinking is correct, that laser is actually a type of digital wave. If it is, the instant that beam of light hits something, it forms a connection with the origin point and establishes a Fox network of sorts. That's what should make it possible for you to connect jump into it. I know it sounds crazy, but you're easily the luckiest person I've ever known. You can do it. Trust yourself and tackle this head on. Yeah, let me just take a laser to the fucking forehead while I'm at it. Just concentrate. If anyone can do this, it's you. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Gotcha, bitch. Alright. So now we have a digital network to explore here. Might as well check these dead ends for things. We got Bakemons. Yeah, I kind of really didn't need him to use the tornado there. Okay, nothing over there. Oh, of course I get back attacked. But I still get to go first, thanks to good old... Thanks to good old Arrow Vigermon. Always going first every time. Bring this guy down. Okay. 
Yeah, I guess this is the other side. First attack. Get wrecked. Get that triple attack going. Okay, what's up? Okay, yeah. Yes, I'm correct. Thank you for reminding me. Alright. I think that might be everything, so I think we can go forward now. God, these guys are getting wrecked. You know what? I need to double check to see if I even am and if I'm still on hard mode. I'm sorry, it's just hard mode is just that brutal. Yes, I am on hard mode. Okay. Never mind then. Doesn't help that I keep running into these guys. They're virus types, so they go down hella quick. I ain't complaining. Alright. Okay, nothing over there. So the exit is just over there. Well, there's definitely something there. But I still need to check the dead end over here. Yeah, I saw I saw something. I saw a glimmer on the left side. Inventory is full and I can't hold any more. Well, shit. Well, it's just HP. It's just HP capsules. They're not that important. Who are you? How did you find me here? Are you some army goon trying to take me back? You're not with the army? Well, I'm an optical weapon Digimon that broke out of a certain country's military. I was developed and trained to be a weapon capable of attacking the real world directly from cyberspace. But I hated it. I hate being worthless to them for any other purpose aside from that. And I hate anybody in the army who, who just tries to treat me like a weapon, so I ran away. You're wondering why I'm attacking the city? It's because I was just practicing my techniques over the network to find something else I could do, that's all. Oh, so my lasers were shooting out into the real world without me even realizing it. Sorry about that. <laughs> Try all I might, no matter how much I run away, I really am just a mean old weapon in the end. I'm wrong? Because if I was a real weapon, there would have been casualties. Huh, <laughs> you're really something. Hey, are you okay? You look alright. I'm so relieved to see you again. If something has happened to you, I would have made it look... If something had happened to you, it would have made me look really terrible. Okay. Made me want to look really terrible as a detective. So I'm glad to see you're okay. Detective? I knew it. You lied with me. You lied to me. You really are just a government dog. No, that's completely different. I'll make you pay for this, you two-faced scumbag. If you're so desperate to make me a weapon again, then I'll give you what you want and then some. Take this. All right, so now we're fighting a tank mon. Okay, I need to change some. I need to change some shit out. All right.
probably gonna one-shot this thing. All right, and we good. This is gonna be the one hitter quitter. Yes, it is. Nightmare three, magic attack. Hmm. Get rid of nightmare two. That's that's enough. I get it. I'm nothing more than a weapon to be fired off. I know that after fighting you now. But if that's the life I have I have to lead, then I wish I'd never been created. That was sad. So it was a program Digibon made by a foreign military, huh? I'm sorry I interrupted your conversation then. Guess I gummed up the works real bad right when you'd won him over. Hmm. So, at least it puts a stop to things, even though it ended poorly. It really did. Now it's become a serious situation. I mean, not only did you find the top secret military weapon, you also, well, destroyed it. If we're not careful here, this could turn into an international incident that even threatens our security treaty with that country. Just when Japan finally got them to move, move their... When just when Japan finally got them to move their bases too, that deal could vanish into thin air because of this. Uh, but I don't think any of this was your fault. Even if it were to lead to World War III taking place, you shouldn't feel guilty. Jesus Christ! Freaking... That's like... That's like backing the bus over me, but just like hitting the brakes like a millimeter from my freaking face. Like... I don't know. That was probably a bad metaphor. Let me think of a better one. Oh, yeah. That's like telling me to back. That's like backing the bus over me with me being the driver and being the person being under it at the same time. All right. Anyway, Lady Luck must really take a shine to you. To tell you the truth, there was actually one other thing that Flash of Light could have been. See, if it hadn't been a normal Mazer, but instead a Fanon Mazer, you uh, wouldn't be standing here talking to us right now. I detected fluctuations in the digital waves, which made me immediately determine that they were functioning as a, mas as a Mazer substitute. However, there, were, there was also the possibility that instead of microwaves being substituted, that it could have been ultrasonic waves. Rather than relying on photons, phonon masers, like the name implies, rely on amplified phonons, which make their properties fundamentally different. If you'd been facing a, a, a phonon maser back there, you probably wouldn't have been able to use it like a normal network line and connect jump. Now, now do you know how lucky you are? You did some great work out there today, kiddo. I guess. But that's what youth is for in the first place, so keep it up. Like I have a choice. I don't even get paid to be here. I agree with Detective Matio what Detective Matioshi said. So it's back to work for you, kiddo. Your next task awaits you. ナイルコープとの間に不正な企業買収があったことが分かっちゃったんです。目の許可を得ずに下の悪い子ちゃんたちが勝手にやった昔々の話ではあるものの花肌遺憾なことであり。
みんなやめてもらっちゃいましたそしてこれからは私が CEO として直接会社を運営していくことにしたんです今までの組織をまるまるっと変えちゃって私がダイレクトに会社を指揮する仕組みにしちゃいます<笑>スピーディーな意思決定でお客様が求める新しいサービスをどんどん生み出していけるようにしていきます実は今日早速その第一弾としてとっておきの大プロジェクトを発表しちゃおうかと思ってるんですそうでは今や皆様の生活の基盤ともいえる弊社の基幹サービスエデンの大幅アップデートです今回のアップデートでことやこんなことができるようになっちゃうんですけど詳細はまだ秘密でもでもエデンのアップデートをいち早く体験できる体験会を開催しちゃおうかと思ってるんです絶対に参加して。神聖神代の誠意そして新しいエデンの可能性を直接体験してくださいね<笑>やられたよええ敵も去る者見事に先手を打たれましたねお前さんが手に入れてくれた調査資料をもとに神城の強制捜査に踏み切ろうとした矢先だ神城側からこの件に関するリークがあった内部告発という形でなつまりこちらが追及する前に向こうから罪を告白したということさうちの上層部はまんまと乗せられてあらかじめ用意されていた証拠の押収とスケープゴートの逮捕で事件を幕引きにしまった推測の域は出ないが内部告発自体岸辺の指示によるものだそしてこの会見も奴の巧妙な作戦の一部ってわけだマスコミに報道されて後手後手で謝罪や釈明に回るより自分たちから発表した方がはるかに印象がいいだろうしかも新 CEO の就任とエデン大幅アップデートの発表を同時にやるとは世間の目を分散させるいい手だまさに岸辺劇場だよ相手はやはりなかなかのやり手だな逆転の一手は岸辺と例のハッカーたちデモンズとのつながりを証明する物的証拠の確保ですねだがデモンズに所属するハッカーたちのアカウントは消されてしまっている状態でな現実世界での特定は難しいだろうそうでしたかロちゃんつまらかったなせっかくつかみかけた神代の尻尾をミスミスい,いえあの件に関しては焦って動いても結果は同じだったかもしれませんまったく。人が真面目に話しているときにせめてもう少し緊張感のある着信音にだな。Hey, you're the one with that ringtone, not me. ほう、白峰ノキアからの呼び出しか。我々のことは気にせず、行ってくるといい。ウサギを見て犬を放つという言葉があるだろ。今は打つ手がない。相手の出方を待ってみるのも一つの作戦だ。All right. Mata, Joshkun no Norukni, Tayorish Kanaina. Mata Kuanoko, Kyochan no Oyajisanga, Tai de Kreta, 
天の助けってやつかもしれんでも少し急いだ方がいいかもしれませんうんあの体をいつまでも維持できる保証はないですしもしも神城が病院にいるあの子の本体に気づいたらただじゃ済まさないかあるいはひょっとしたらあえて泳がせているのかもしれませんとっくに気がついているのにねだから悪いことにデジモンを利用するハッカーたちをこれ以上ほっとけないってのあんひゅ遊びに付き合ってる暇はねえんだごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごごご仲間になってくれなくったって勝手にやるもん。あの、you're kind of forcing me into the situation here。なあ、あんた、神城優子だよな。あいつから話は聞いてるぜ。何してんだよ、こんなとこで。京子さんに教えてもらったんです。あの人がここにいるってあ,あ,あいつに酔うってわけなあいつはこの中だうぜえのも一緒だけどさっきは真剣な顔して何見てたんだあいいえフェイギーズ腹減ってんのそんじゃまたな
ミヒルの俺クールな俺超イケてるみたいなまあいいわこうなったらこうなったらこうなったら私がリーダーやっちゃうんだからちょ何よその盛大な驚きと疑問は君メンバー集め手伝ってよね Wait, why me? Pushing it, isn't it? Oh, God, that was below the belt. Weird, I thought you were the dictionary here. Well, no more quests, but I know some things have happened. HP attach B. Also, I got a lot of stuff. Let me know if you have any trouble investigating. I'll help you where I can. Alrighty then. Well, I can say for sure. I can say for sure. That's gonna be it for this video. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. Even though there was a lot of talking, not much fighting. But it's not until we get to like towards like the end of the game that stuff starts picking up. So just try to bear with me until then. Because, I mean, I'm the one playing it as well, so you gotta keep that in mind. <laughs> Anywho, that's gonna be it for this video. I'm gonna get back on this. I am going to finish it. I swear I will. And, 
now, I'll see you guys on the next video. Till then, see you then.